Hi guys, today is day 21 of the 30 day challenge here at Amazing Life Ministries, learning to live God's amazing plans in your life in full color. And so today we are learning on day 21 to have faith in God. And this does require action. So it's one thing to have faith, to say I have faith, to know faith, to learn faith, but real faith is developed and strengthened when we take action in our faith. And action means trusting. So we step out in faith, but it requires that step, that step out on the water, the step out in faith to conquer the mountains before us, to have that small mustard seed of faith. And that's what the Bible tells us. We only need a mustard seed of faith, teeny tiny little seed of faith. And I, you know, for me personally, I am convinced that it really isn't the size of the faith that matters, but the sincerity of the faith, the actual trust of the faith, the are you saying it or are you living it kind of faith. And so today that is what we are going to learn. We are going to go before our Father, seek Him in intimate prayer and um, counsel this morning, today, this afternoon, whenever you get the chance to do it today. But I want you to go before him and I want you to seek him in prayer and ask him to reveal to you three things that you need to require complete faith in him as you step out on the water. Things that God has been calling you to do or act or say or stop or, or move in a different direction. List those down, and I want you from this day forward to pull out day 21 of your journal, having faith in God, and the three things that he revealed to you today, I want you to lay your hand on that journal, and I want you to pray over them every single day. Father God, I seek you, and I surrender my, my entire life to you today. I have faith, the faith of David facing Goliath, Father. I have the faith of David that will face any obstacles in my life, that as I am going out on my amazing journey of life, that I wholeheartedly, without any doubt, know for a fact that you have a good plan for my life and that you have prepared my way, Father God. I have sought you for the last 20 days, Father God, and I have learned your voice. I know you love me. I know you have a good plan for me. And today I am surrendering that from this day forward, I will walk in faith. I will step out in action. I will no longer just use the words of knowing you and having faith, but my body, my life will resemble faith. People will see it and know that you are alive and well in me. And so in the Bible, in Mark 11, 22, it says, Jesus answered them directly to his disciples. He said, have faith in God. Pretty simple. Jesus says, Jesus says it to you too. Have faith in God. Also in Habakkuk 3, 3, it says, faith also requires timing. So we have to have faith in God even through the timing. Sometimes timing doesn't look like the way that we want it, but it's not about what we want. It's about having faith in God, in His timing. And so today that's what our journey is about. It's about learning to have faith in God. And so I pray that you will enjoy your um, 20, 30 minutes with the Lord, seeking Him on the things that He wants you to have faith over. And from this day forward, you are going to pray over those items. And I know that you will be able to declare victory on those as well. So have a blessed day. If you are seeing this for the first time, I would love to have you come join us on this journey of living out God's amazing plans in your life. All you have to do is go to godsamazingplans.com, subscribe, watch everyday video encouragement from me, and then there will be an assignment, and then you'll spend time in prayer and worship. So have a blessed day and be a blessing to others.